Today we're here to talk about our Hercules calf systems. A um, little bit to start out here, our Hercules calf systems are always mounted on a blue sub panel like this. Um, anything that correlates with calves, as you can see, will follow through the pump panel here, has a blue denotation to it. Pierce Manufacturing offers two main hydraulic calves units. We have a 120 CFM unit and a 140 CFM unit. The 120 and the 140 CFM unit are capable of either one two and a half inch discharge or two inch and three quarter or inch and a half discharges. We also offer a 200 CFM PTO driven calf system. The 200 CFM unit is capable of three two and a half inch discharges or a two and a half inch discharge and three inch and three quarter or inch and a half lines. For Hercules calf's operation, the first step we have to have is the truck running. We then need to secure a water source and have the pumping gear. Our water source can be from a hydrant or onboard tank on the truck itself. Then our next step is we need to turn the compressor on and have our foam system running at a minimum of 0.3%. For our PTO systems, you can turn the PTO switch on in the cab and simply turn the compressor on back here. For our hydraulic systems, we just need to turn the system on. Once you turn the system on and the system is in auto, what it's trying to do is essentially match the water pressure or chase the water pressure to ensure we have a balanced system. Most of the time we're gonna run our calf systems in the auto balance feature. Like I said before, that is going to match or chase the air pressure to the water pressure flowing out of the discharges. We also have the ability to manually balance the compressor itself if needed to be. In order to introduce air to our foam discharges, like I said before, as long as we're running 0.3% on them, simply flip open the protective switch guard, turn on the switches. As you can see, they illuminate green, and we are now injecting air into the respective discharges. We can do that individually for each, each discharge that has calves associated with it. As you can see, this truck has four available calves discharges. When running with calves, you're gonna to wanna to leave your discharges about halfway, oh, the valve's halfway open. With calves, the further out you go, the wetter, wetter the consistency becomes. The further in you go, the drier, more shaving cream-like the consistency becomes. Each discharge is individually controlled via your water flow that you're putting in, how open and closed your valves are. An easy explanation we like to give to our customers on how to run calves is the one quarter, half, three quarter method. Your one quarter open on your ball valve itself is gonna be your dry, most shaving, -like, most shaving cream like consistency of calves. Half is gonna be about mid, and your three quarters is gonna be your wettest calves that we recommend. In order to shut off calves from each individual discharge, we simply turn off the rocker switches pause in between the next one, turn off the next one, a little bit of a pause, and the next one. Air injection to those outlets is now stopped and you are back to just flowing foam concentrated water. Remember with calves, the couple things we wanna make sure we have is our water pump running and an established water supply. So on our blue calves panel itself, we do have an air pressure gauge. We do have an oil temp of the compressor itself and we have a high oil temp light with an audible alarm in case something should happen with the compressor. We also do have your airflow meter. This is how many standard cubic feet a minute of air the compressor is putting out while utilizing the calf system on the truck. Pierce's Hercules calf systems are water cooled. We do provide an inline strainer behind the passenger side pump panel. We need departments to clean out the water strainer as directed in your service manual. With our Hercules cast systems, we do give customers the option to place a tool air outlet on the pump panel itself. If you are using the tool air outlet, you still need the water pump engaged and a valid water source, either on board or hooked to a fire hydrant itself. On the Hercules cast units, we do offer the option to provide a tool air outlet on the pump panel. If you are using the tool air outlet, you do not need to be flowing foam However, you need to have your water pump engaged and a water source to the water pump. Either it can be from onboard 
or an external water supply. Wrapping up, once again, we do offer on the Hercules systems 120, 140, or a 200 CFM CAFS unit. If you have further questions, please reach out to your Pierce dealer for further assistance.